Hi everybody! So today I thought I would take you on a tour of what I collect, which is Fiesta Wear. I have a love for color and these dishes do not disappoint me. So stay tuned if you are interested in seeing my collection of Fiesta Wear. Um, to get into it, I've been collecting Fiesta Wear, I would say, for about five years now, give or take a few months or so. But anyways, so it's always kind of been a traditional gift that I um, get for Christmas from my family because they all know I love Fiesta Wear. So I thought I would show you what I've been collecting. I typically have a lot of the brighter colors, which are things that you can still purchase today. Um, I typically purchase my Fiesta Wear, if it's something you're interested in, either from Kohl's, Yonkers, Macy's, um, what else, Herberger's, those kinds of stores. So if that's something you're interested, definitely check out their websites for Fiesta Wear. But I will get in and show okay, you so what I This collect. is my first area I would like to show you today, and I apologize for the glare on the top left. I have shut the curtains to eliminate some of the lighting glare that's coming through, and so that's just what it is. But anyway, so this is a, um, I don't know if you'd call it a hutch or a buffet. I purchased this off of Target.com probably five or six years ago, so I'm not sure if it's still available, but I love it. It's modern. It holds just enough pieces, and I love the glass so you can see in all of the color. So I will go ahead and open it up and show you inside. Okay, so here's a look inside of it um, on the top shelf. I will show you. There's only a few pieces up here. I have a few of the gravy boats. So I have this, um, I'm not even sure what color this is. This is a retired color, but it's like a lighter yellow, as well as a red, which is called Scarlet. Gravy boat up there. I love those. We use those for holidays. I also have a, this is called a mini disc pitcher, and I have a band-aid on. This is called a mini disc pitcher, and I use this, I don't, I use this more for decor, but I know that people can use it for creamer, um, syrup. I only have one just because I thought it was so cute, and I wanted to put add that to my collection. And then the last thing on the top that is Fiesta are these drinking glasses. I do not use these. I purchased these. These were a thrifted find on Facebook. But they are like a light gray color. I'm not sure of the name of the color. Um, but these are also retired. And so I just have these more for decor. So I have four of those. Okay. So moving down here. On the next few shelves, I have just some random collection pieces here. Over on this side, I have all of my cups and saucers. So I typically, when I buy my place settings, I buy the five piece place settings and they come with these cute teacups and plates. So I do not use these for every day, but they are so cute to display. And this is a turquoise and this is probably my favorite Fiesta color. I just really love the, the blue. It's really, really pretty. So I have a ton of different saucers and cups. I'm honestly not even quite sure. Let's see. I'll count them for you sometime. But So I have all of those just out to display. And those are just fun to move around and um, change out the color. So it just adds a cute little pop of color. And then on this side over here, I have just a few of my baking pieces. So this is actually my loaf pan. I got this for Mother's Day last year in my favorite turquoise color. I bake a lot of my banana breads into this loaf pan. So I have that as well as my pie pan. I love this. I make my spaghetti pie in this and any other pies I choose to make. And this is also in one of my favorite colors. This is in a sunflower is what the color is called. So I have those. I'll just place those right there. Moving down, I still have more of the cups and saucers, and then on the bottom, I will go ahead and show you what I have down there. Okay, so down here, I thrifted these on a Facebook site, but I have two. I think these are vegetable bowls, so I have a lemongrass, which is kind of like a lime green, 
And then I also have a chocolate brown color, which I'm not even sure of the official color of this, because um, this one is also retired. So I got a good price on those. So those are vegetable bowls. I typically will serve vegetables in these on um, different occasions. So I'll place those to the side while I grab the rest of the stuff out. I also on the bottom have a few different serving platters. I have the scarlet red. I have two of those just because I've been gifted both of those. And then I have a very, very pale pink underneath that red one. And then on the other side, the only other piece of fiesta wear I have on the shelf, I will show you right now, is My newest piece that I purchased is a turquoise casserole pan, I guess you would call it, and it is wonderful. You can bake it in the oven, and it's just beautiful. It's a very, very heavy piece and a very expensive piece, so um, I'm still looking for its final home, but for now, I just have it on my kit. My cake platter right now. So that is a look at everything in my hutch. So I will give you one final look here. And now I will move to the next area. Okay, so I turned off the light for one moment because of the glare that was coming on the screen, but this is a look by our dining room table. I have built-ins on both sides, so it has been a perfect place to uh, display some of my fiesta wear. So now I will jump in and show you the left side first. Okay, so you can pretty much see what I have in these shelves. On the top shelf, I received that red platter for Christmas. It is just a red handled server. I'm not to, I don't know the original or the correct name of it, but it is in the scarlet color. I also have up top that is a jam canister, I guess you would call it, or jam jar. It is the smallest canister you can get, and it's so cute. I have it in a deep purple color, which is also known as plum. I also up top there have a one of the um, retired colors, that light gray color, that I purchased with those cups I just showed you. And it has a cute little Fiesta logo on there. And then underneath that, I have this cute little tray that I'm going to show you okay, here real So quick. this is the tray that the guys have sitting under the gray pitcher up there. And this is a bread tray, and it's so cute. I love it. It's not super long, but it's long enough that um, you could put lots of different things in here to display or when you're having a party. It's just so cute. And this is in the, uh, oh my gosh, I'm drawing a blank. What color is this? I'm drawing a blank. I'll put in the comments below what color this is. So, yeah, there's that. And then in the next row, I have my canisters. So I have the large and medium canister there. I do not have the small yet in its place is the mason jar, um, but I have the large turquoise canister and then I have the medium flamingo, which is a retired color. It's like a pink color that's cute. And then off to the side, I do have a few bowls. I can show you those. I also in here have a spoon rest in the turquoise color that I like. I have a hostess bowl, which has a design around it. I also store some things the kids, um, <laughs> hiding things from the kids, like bouncy balls in that bowl. And then this is the newest color, it's Poppy. It's like a really, really bright, pretty orange, and this came in the companion set. So this bowl was part of it, and then I also received a platter that I will show you in a little bit. Moving down, I have a few pieces on this shelf. I have the heart-shaped bowl in the lapis color. It's like a cute, pretty blue. And then I also have my salt and pepper shakers. They are huge. I love them. They have salt and pepper on them because we use them at Easter, but they're in the cute peacock color. They have handles. Very, very nice size. They're almost too big in certain occasions, but so pretty. So I really only use those when I'm entertaining. So now we'll jump in and show okay, you the other this side. is a look 
at the other side, I just have a lot of random pieces over here. At the very top, I have a, I believe that's a pizza plate. I'm not quite sure exactly what it is. That was also a thrifted piece. It's in that lemongrass color, the limeish color. I have that turquoise heart bowl, so I have two heart bowls. I have one of my teacups and saucers displayed there. And then I also at the top have a few more bowls for serving. These bowls are huge. I'm not going to pull them out, but they are gigantic. And then I also have a um, smaller plum vegetable bowl. So that really, really pretty purple color. In the next row, I have a, a lot of cute pieces. Let me go ahead and get closer so you can see them a little bit better. So over there I have a disc pitcher in the sunflower color. I have a teapot. Those are so pretty in the lapis color. I have a utensil holder that I'm just using for display at the moment. I also have a vase and then I have a trivet in the ivory color. So um, that are those are the pieces there. And then down on the next shelf I have the platter display that came in the companion set in the poppy color as well as this um, I guess sugar and creamer set and that is so cute in the scarlet color. Okay so here is a look in our everyday cabinet. So this, these are all of the dishes that we use on a daily basis. It's probably not too feasible for me to pull all of them out and show you but I will zoom in. I will take my camera up there and try to get up and close and personal with my dishes and let you know what they all are. Okay so in the top shelf here I have these bouillon bowls. They are used for you could use them for French dips, you know, for the au jus, or just when you serve like a side of something. Those are really, really cute to serve, so I have four of those in various colors. I also have these really super sweet fruit dishes in a rainbow of colors, but we serve ice cream in those. They're really, really cute. So that's what we eat desserts and ice creams in. Over here, these are called the, what are they called, jumbo bowls possibly? I'll write below if they aren't, but I have four of those. These have all been thrifted, so they aren't in the, you know, the super vibrant colors that I would typically buy. A few of them are retired colors, except for the lemongrass, so it's like a brown, a lime, and a few different purples up top there. I like to also serve, when it's just our little family eating, I will serve our vegetables in those bowls. Moving down. These are the plates we use every single day. These are the luncheon plates. So they're just really a smaller version of the dinner plate. I like these because they also control portions. So I just have a cute little rainbow of colors there. Those you buy separately. And then I mentioned that I buy the five piece place settings. So these two stacks of plates come in those five piece place settings. Um, you get these salad plates. These are the tiny plates. Basically, you could fit like a piece of toast on them. So I have those all there. And then I also have, you know, the dinner plates. And these I use for holidays or just when we're having a large meal um, that we need more plate space. So those are very, very big. <laughs> and then down on the last shelf, I put our, we'll start over here, cereal bowls. I have a ton of bowls. Some of them are being washed at the moment, like my, I have more reds and pinks and oranges that typically go right there. Move those. Those are not <laughs> Fiesta. Uh, but you can just see I have a ton of bowls. So these also come in that five place, place setting and we eat cereal in those. And then over here, these are thrifted, but I, I love them. They are the square salad plates, I believe. Um, they're really, really cute. They have like a little bit of a arch to them, I guess you would say. I'm not sure of the correct terminology, but you get what I mean. So those were thrifted, so I did not choose the colors of those, but um, just really, really cute. Sometimes I'll pull those out and use. So that's one more look here. And I have a few more things to show you. With our glasses that we use every day, I store a lot of these mugs. Um, I have, I think, six different colors up there. 
I like to use those on occasion um, to serve coffee and for anyone who wants a normal size cup of coffee and I'll show you what I'm okay, talking so about. Okay, so I'm here. in my messy coffee cabinet right now, but these are the jumbo mugs that I drink coffee out of every day. And they are jumbo size. I love them. I have eight of them um, and they're just huge and I love them so much. So I have them in just, you know, a variety of colors. Back there and then I also purchased this sugar caddy to put sugar packets in okay so right now I'm on my countertop and this is a pedestal bowl you can see it's raised up a little bit I have it in the sunflower color right now I am using it for a fruit bowl I think it's the perfect size for that so I you can see I need to get groceries but it's so cute I love this bowl for everyday okay, use. Okay, I pulled these out of my cabinet. <clears throat> these are located in my baking cabinet, but these are the smaller version salt and pepper shakers. These are more our everyday um, ones that we use. They're so cute. They're teeny tiny. I have them in the red scarlet color. So I cute. also have this Fiesta utensil caddy. It, as you can see, says Fiesta. It came with a lot of these serving spoons or things that I use for everyday cooking. I've also added in some Fiesta spatulas. Um, just to really dress it up and add more color to our countertop. Okay, top. some things I pulled out of my cupboards. I have measuring cups and measuring spoons, which I love. I use all of the time. Totally would recommend them. They are so cute. Fun colors. Love them. It also comes with these silicone pinch bowls that I really don't use too often. So those typically just sit up in my cabinet for now. Um, very cute colors. If you're into that, they're they seem really nice. So... Those. Okay, a few lost, forgotten pieces. Not really. In my dishwasher. <laughs> anyway, so I also have this butter dish in Scarlet. I love this. I only use it on special occasions to set butter out on the table. And then these spoons, I'm not sure, I think it's called like a hostess set, came all together. I use these every day in like veggies and whatnot. I don't really use these two as much, but these three I use very often and love them. I also received this as a gift for Christmas one year. It is the block of knives. Super heavy duty. I love the colors. This sits on my countertop. It comes with an array of different knives, a knife sharpener, and a pair of scissors. And I love this. We use it every day. The only bummer is it says the knives are not dishwasher safe. Um, but otherwise I love that. It's a huge heavy, qual heavy duty quality block of wood right so I have a few that. other things that I love because of the color, but I also use all of the time are just, you know, the pot holders. Love those. And then the towels. I have a ton more, but I'm not going to show them all to you of like the bar mops. But these are the cute towels that I typically will hang on my oven and we use to dry our hands on. Such cute colors. Love the patterns. So I hang those up and love those. All right, well that sums up my Fiesta Wear collection. What do you think? Do you think I have a problem? Perhaps, but I love it. I love the color. They are dishes we will have our entire lives, and I hope that someday I can pass them on to my children to use. So thank you for watching, and if you have any questions, comments, want to know any specifics, please let me know in the comments below, and I will do my best to get back to you and answer your question. Thank you. See you next time. Bye-bye. <laughs>